putting this bed together more. Violet slept in hers last night. Hudson's asleep. Nellie's gonna watch him while he sleeps for me. And Aaron's coming and we're gonna hopefully knock these beds out like that. It's really not that hard. We just started way too late yesterday. So I'm hoping that uh, this goes quickly and we can get this done. The curtains come in today and then we'll see if we can get the desk up. The chairs are shipped, but I have no clue. It doesn't tell me where they are. Sure, you can play the Pac-Man. So anyway, that's what we're gonna do. Get these beds up, put the new bedding on. We don't have the top on yet, but she's been waiting and waiting. Do you love it? She's not gonna look at us because she feels awkward. But that's so cool, huh? Oh, Aria, it's beautiful. I see outside. Yeah, you can see outside, huh? Ahead, you see Mama's car. Aria. Pretty soon, Liam's bed's gonna be up there, so <laughs> you won't have that much space. Luna wants up. What's up? <laughs> she's like, that's the perfect spot to see outside. Yeah. Came and brought lunch. Hi, Gimme. She's not listening. <laughs> We got it put together. Yay! I was saying say hi, Kimmy, but you weren't listening. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm thinking how high that is and what it'd be like to be I'm like, so, so excited. I always wanted to be high. When now we can put on all the bedding. Oh, so be fun. We finished. We even have the bedding on. Let me see if I can get you up there and show you Liam's. All right, Liam's is up here. I'm using the tripod so if it's shaky. He picked Star Wars. Arias, yay Aria, and Violet, yay Violet. We haven't touched up paint yet because we're really not sure if we're gonna paint or not, so we're just waiting. 
But Aria has her own ladder. Yep, there's your monkey. So it's Aria's ladder for Aria's use. Liam's ladder for Liam's use. We need to hang up Violet's little thing. Yep, her little, they all have their own little things to hold their personal belongings. That way they can keep their books, whatever they want in there, right? Special stuffed animals. And then I'm gonna hang up the stuffed animal nets. You love it? Yeah. You so happy? Yes. Yes. Yay. Liam on his bed. He picked Emperor Strikes Back. The curtain should be in today, too. All right, buddy. Smile. Yay, Liam. You love it? Mm -hmm. Oh, lay down. Is it comfy? Yes, it is. Ah, it's a good life, He's huh? on her bed. Can't wait for the curtain. So it'll look so much yeah. better. Yeah. Smile. Mm -hmm. Yay. Oh, and there's Violet. Hi. <laughs> Yay, Violet. They're all done. Cheese. Yay. bunk beds all put together oh my back is killing me killing me killing me it hurts so bad so probably gonna wait and do the desks tomorrow when the curtains come in hopefully today I will put those up that'll be easy but my gosh my back is hurting I did not use the back workout machine thing today at the gym because my back was hurting already so anyway Hudson's taking his nap right now and I am just gonna sit here oh, I feel so nice although I have no meat thawed for dinner so we're going to have to get some chicken out or something. And I'm thinking I'm either going to have Aaron grill out chicken if he feels like it. He's been working, obviously, with me doing the bunk beds. And now he's actually working on something on his car, which he enjoys working on his car. It's like his fun thing. I don't know why. Um, Yeah, Liam has a nosebleed, doesn't he? Yeah, that's why. Yeah. Anyway, I am either going to have Aaron grill out chicken. I want to do some kind of Alfredo, maybe. Yes, yes, yes. So I have to make homemade Alfredo. Either that or I do like stroganoff, and I know we have the stuff for that, and we have meatballs in the freezer. So, I think we're going to do one of those with some salad, and that'll be dinner. If we do chicken, I need to thaw it out. Like, hurry up and thaw it out, because it's frozen solid. Oh, shh. Sissy was waking them up, huh? So, those are our two dinner options. We're going to pick one and have that for dinner. It is 4.15, so give me brought us lunch, but I imagine in an hour or so, everyone's going to be hungry for dinner. Go, buddy, go! Woo, are we at? We gonna pick up all the trash. Well, Are we picking up all the trash? Okay, you go on your bed. Got a big, huge trash bag. Picking up the trash. Got the curtains hung. I'll show you all in a minute. And the Spider-Man off. 
can kind of see him there. Hi, Liam. You gonna help me pick up the trash? Oh, are you trash? No. No, I don't know what happened to Aria's face. She woke up with... Can we see it? You can't see it as much on camera. It's really red in real life. I bought the trash all picked up. So got some blankets to put away. And we hung the stuffed animal things. Aria's had to get hung into the bed. What does? Okay, your horsey goes in there. And now, um, my horsey Very nice. So Aria's been organizing her animals. We had to hang it there because I didn't want to buy her head. That seemed uncomfortable. And Violet is down there, but she hasn't put anything in it yet because she went with my mom to run some errands, so. All right, that's done. Violet was so sweet. She went to Dollar Tree with my mom and she brought back something for like everybody. They had, they also got some Parmesan, which I need for the Alfredo that I'm trying to make. She's gonna find my Italian seasoning. But she was so sweet. She got staff for a party that she's gonna have tonight with Liam and Violet. I'm looking for Italian seasoning. Ice cream and chips is what I found it, is what she got. She got me a new eye mask. She remembered that mine was broken. She got Aria a toy. She just went all out. Violet is always so sweet when she goes shopping. All right, where are you? Aren't you Violet? Yes. Yeah, Aria got a horsey. Where are you, sissy? Woo, there you are. So anyway, I am beat. I am tired. I do not feel like cooking. Um, but we got, we ate out yesterday. We got Panda Express. I don't want to pay for food again. So I'm going to cook. We're going to make homemade Alfredo sauce with some frozen meatballs that I popped in the air fryer and spaghetti noodles. And broccoli. Those are clean dishes, by the way. So anyway, I'm tired. My back hurts, but it's 637. So I'm going to cook this by the time that's done. Hudson is really into everything. <laughs> By the time that's done, it'll be almost time, or be time to eat, then it'll almost be time to go to bed, you see? So, there's hope. Anyway, I'm gonna put my phone down, cause my baby is trying to climb up on this stove. I hate when there's boiling water on the stove and a baby in the kitchen. <sighs> Makes me so nervous. I was watching America's Next Top Model once, many, many moons ago, and that was, I think, do they still do that show? I don't know, I'm talking like 10 years ago I was watching that show. And me and Aaron used to watch that together. That's very funny. Um, anyway, and there was a model on there who had half of a scarred face because her mom accidentally, her mom didn't pour it, but she was in the kitchen with her mom and boiling water got poured on her as a baby. And ever since I heard that story, I am so nervous about boiling water and babies. I love having my kids in the kitchen help me cook, but when they're just babies and they're in the kitchen and there's other people in the kitchen and things are moving and there's water boiling, that is just like a fear of mine. Every time I vlog, that drives me nuts. Will someone please comment and be like, hey, Chelsea, clean off the top of your fridge because I'll see that comment and remember. So right now, comment, hey, Chelsea, clean off the top of your fridge and I will do it. It'll be fun to see if in the next vlog that is clean. I know. Anyway, so I'm going to go move my baby so I don't have to be paranoid and I'll show you dinner when it gets done. So I'm doing a home and I got this host for all yet. Oh my gosh. Um, because, you know, a table for flush. So there we go. Oh, uh, you can take your horse back if you want. Um, got this for mom. Okay, I got this for mom right here because mom needed a new one. Horse broke. Okay, I'm um, I'm done. Uh, okay, now I got this chocolate. Mom ate one because you know it's healthy. I got this for my wand to say to this because we're doing stuff for our wand. Um, for my cat, my cat Ginger, um, she likes treats, so that will be good. I do chips. I'm having a party tonight, so that should be the good. Next, I have these like, pinkish roses, white roses. This tub that is going to be used for a vase. And then for the resort and a party is ice cream. Two fans, we have, I'm pretty sure, peanut butter, and then two tears, two So yeah, yeah, that is the haul. Hey. Finally time to eat. Mm. Yum, yum. Hudson's eating too. I got meatball. <laughs> is it good? You got a meatball? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Is it good? Yeah. Yeah, yeah is it good? <laughs> They're having a disco party in their room. Got a disco light for Christmas. Who got that for you? Give me. Yeah. And they, you can't really see them, but they are here dancing and having a disco party. They, yeah, they got snacks and arcade games. I can't see you. 
<laughs> okay, I won't tell. I mentioned that Melissa's bed came in, so now she got her sheets on. Her sweater's there, but that's okay. Anyway, so looking good. Animal stories for One bedtime. One morning, the little mouse heard a rustling in the undergrowth. Surprise! Called a familiar voice. It was his big cousin from the town. I thought I'd pay you a visit, the town mouse said, and get some country at the end.